The Attorney General's office is investigating a deadly shooting in Manchester. Police rushed to the scene in the area of Lake Avenue just after 3.30 yesterday afternoon. When they arrived, they found a man dead from apparent gunshot wounds. Ray Brewer joins us live now at the Manchester Police Department. And Ray, have there been any arrests made in this case? So far, no arrests, Sean, but investigators tell us they have identified everyone who was involved with the shooting. The exact circumstances surrounding this shooting, though, are still unclear. This Manchester neighborhood is uneasy after a man was found dead in the area of 144 Lake Avenue. Well, we heard the gunshots first, and we automatically looked over at the window where they're climbing out of. One woman who lives right across the street from where the shooting happened says she heard the gunshots and many people started to run away. She did not want to be identified. It's scary, but we had a bunch of us, and it's like... You know, you, you just kind of all stick around each other and be observant. Police say the man who was shot was killed in this alleyway. A car in the alley appeared to be covered in blood. The attorney general's office says two different places are being looked at for evidence. Part of the investigation is whether or not there is a foul self-defense claim in this case. Again, while no arrests have been made in this case, authorities say they have identified everyone involved and there is no immediate threat to the public. The parties who were involved uh, did know each other, so it's not a random incident. Uh, we certainly always caution people whenever there's a homicide in the area, that they should take that into account when they go about their daily lives. But we have no specific information that leads us to believe that the general public is at risk. Anyone who may have witnessed the shooting is asked to call Manchester Police. Now, the name of the man who was killed has not been released at this time. An autopsy is scheduled for later today. Reporting live in Manchester, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.